Hey y'all, I'm Parisian and this is Dream of Parisian Tarot. We're gonna get a few cards from my Capricorns, okay? So please like this video if it resonates at all. Also, if you're new to my channel, please subscribe and don't forget to check out my TikTok. The link is down below in the description box. And if you would like a personal reading, that information is also down below in the description box. So let's get a few cards from my Capricorns, okay? The first card I'm seeing, it says an ex-friend worried and thinking about why you got distance. So you could have cut some type of friend off, detached from them, something like that. And they're trying to figure out why you did that. Evidently, they did something towards you, all right? They could have been shady or they tried to sabotage you, lie on your name, something like that. But it says they knew about it, so they're all involved. So look, it was a group of people um, that all knew about what, whatever this person did to you in some type of way, which means they are uh, a part of it in some type of way, especially if they did nothing to fix it. They did nothing to try to balance the situation out, okay? Um, or if they just didn't tell you at all, you know what I'm saying? But it says, who is going to take care of grandma or granddad? So somebody in the family could be sick or ill and needed some type of help. There could be conversations or arguments about that. And it says, your name keeps coming up in conversations. So uh, people keep bringing up your name in some type of way. This could also have something to do with family members as well. But it says, get rid of your options. I'm all you need. So they could be dealing with other people or you could be dealing with other people. But somebody wants to be the only one. And it says, your ancestors are talking to you. So definitely listen, okay? It says, I don't want to be friends with the fake ass bitch. That's right. So that's probably why the first card that we seen was ex friend word and thinking about why you got distance. So you could have cut their ass off because they were doing shit like this. I hope my friend doesn't find that I'm talking to, talking to him. So some of y'all definitely had some fucked up friends that was talking to your person behind your back or either trying to sabotage your connection in some type of way. Someone is stalking your foundation or they're stalking wherever you usually be at. And it says they can't break your spirit. So somebody is trying to break you or break your happiness or break your peace in some type of way, but they just can't. They can't go up against you. It was a lot of manipulation going on it around, and somebody could have a BMW car that's involved in this situation. Uh, they worried about you because the truth is being revealed. Uh, we got a club invite. All right, so somebody could be inviting you to some type of party or club something um holding you back someone could be holding you back from something and it says females are hating you over this man so some of y'all are de dealing with a certain type of man who um a lot of females want or something like that and they trying to attack you uh, but you got female friends with bringing a lot of support okay everyone knows you deserve an apology for what they did to you and somebody could be a daddy's girl, or you could be a daddy's girl, something. Um, your family members are hating. I'm glad this came out because I, in the pre-show that I was just doing, I was seeing that um, there's a family member who, who could have did something towards you because you had something that they wanted, especially something revolving around somebody's lover or some shit like that. But the thing about it is that this family member, they don't know if they love you or hate you. So it's some real back and forth shady type shit going on where they could have been trying to say certain things about you or say they knew something about you to bring down your worth or or like break your spirit in some type of way also they were telling this person lies about you to like take your person from you or just fuck up your love life or something they were doing some weird shit yeah they were trying to interfere with the divine contract uh somebody could be worried about child support you need to lock your window somebody could be trying to steal from you or someone could just try to be in your information or some shit uh there could be someone who's a marine biologist you could be burning bridges with people. And I think that's what's coming out with Scorpio. Some of y'all can definitely be dealing with the Scorpio. You can have Scorpio in your chart. Both in a relationship. So you could be dealing with someone. Your person could be dealing with someone. Yeah. Here we go right here. They tried to make him uninterested in you. That's what I'm saying. And it could have been, for some of y'all, we see our friends as our family or our family as our friends. But some of y'all, this is definitely your family members that were trying to come in between you and your person. All right? Somebody, family members ain't shit. I'm trying to tell y'all, go to jail for stealing. Somebody is stealing shit. It says, I, I never wanted to break up, okay? Okay, pineapple smoothies will be good for you at this time. And somebody could have bought a pet. 
attention will be drawn to you. So you could be getting a lot of attention for something that you're doing, saying, or posting. And supernatural things could be happening. Now, somebody could be receiving some type of karma here, okay? Don't come back, toxic bitch. You could be cutting people out, burning bridges. Somebody going over undercover because they want you back. Okay, so somebody it's like somebody going undercover to get some type of information or something like that or trying to go undercover to get some information about some social injustice. So this could be online. Somebody could be attacking somebody online or something like that. Or this could be like between a group of people. All right. Or like on a group chat, something like that. Somebody was being attacked here. Respect your partner. So there could be arguments between um, uh, in, in a relationship or something. And there is someone watching you from fake accounts. But I'm seeing I'm sorry. So there is someone who wants to apologize to you. And you have an imposter. They're trying to copy off you. They're trying to steal your personality, your style, shit like that. And you could be forgiving and releasing. All right? They missed the opportunity because of a lie. Yes. So, like I said, somebody was in um your lover's ear, lying, stuff like that. And he could have listened to it at first. And now he feels like he missed some type of opportunity with the lover. We got soccer team. Somebody could be on a soccer team. Some type of team, period. Somebody could just like soccer. But it says put something on the grill. So, somebody could be putting something on the grill. Having some type of family out in a family out of get together or some shit like that. We have an entrepreneur. You could be an entrepreneur. Your person could be, there could be a nurse involved in this situation, and someone could be into poverty. So, they could definitely be putting you in a third-party situation, or uh, y'all could be in a poly relationship. But, yeah, you could be making some good choices and receiving good karma. And it says, trying to look into your medical records. So, someone is a nurse, and somebody was looking into somebody's medical records. And it says, you're quick to cut someone off, okay? An Aquarius could have something to do with this, or an Aquarius could be in your chart or something like that. But, yeah, we got, how the fuck did you know that? So, somebody's very intuitive. They knew some shit. They could have posted some shit. They could have said some shit, right? And they try to figure out how you knew. And they haven't learned that lesson, which means they keep trying to attack you in some type of way. Criminal family. So, someone has criminal family members that could be going to jail for stealing or something. Get back to work and take action. And it says, watching your business grow fast. And so someone's definitely jealous of another person's business or something like that. We got beating yourself up. And you need to align your chakras. So somebody's chakras is off balance right now. They finna send you a sweet message. They will pay to know your info. That's what I'm saying. Somebody going on the cover to get some information on somebody. But somebody was lying saying they had information on another person. All right, there is somebody going to nursing school. And people are observing you. They all trying to figure out exactly what's going on. Beach trip with family, okay? And something about a beach house, all right? So somebody going to a beach house or a beach trip with family or people that they see as family. It's a lot of hidden feelings and emotions going on about this. Something about Christmas gifts or gifts, period. And it says, you got fans, honey. Yeah, so they have mutual friends as you in some type of way. And a lot of mess is going on. These people getting exposed. Yeah, haters can't hold you back. And your family is involved. Okay, so definitely watch out for your Because I was seeing that shit heavy. Somebody could be selling plasma or saying that somebody's selling plasma. You could be making home-cooked meals. It says, if I called, would you answer? money good and it says your story is going public so somebody's story the situation is going public everybody talking about it and it says get up get up get out and do something go have fun someone here loves expensive things or expensive gifts an exciting event is coming up and say my heart belongs to you somebody could be suffering in silence and it says i'm not trying to hurt you i want to heal you can you pay my rent and work with the wrong person? That's what I'm saying. Somebody worked with snakes. These snakes lied and spread it, um, rumors and shit like that. Also, know if this is not happening directly to you, it could be happening to your person or somebody around you or somebody that you know. So put it with every effects, okay? I could be saying he when really it could be a she. So flip it and reverse it how need be.
All right, as soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my um, Capricorns is spiritual. But so somebody is receiving some type of spiritual abundance. Thank you, angels, for blessing me with infinite abundance, right? And somebody is trying to study and learn how or why you're getting some type of spiritual abundance. Thank you, angels, for allowing me to see that every day is a learning day. So somebody like learning about you, learning from you, because remember, they will pay to know your information, okay, and how you're getting all this abundance, because that's what I was seeing in the pre-shuffle. All right, we got live your joy. So definitely go out and have fun. Someone's definitely focused on happiness at this time. Thank you, angels, for supporting me as I follow my joy. So follow what makes you happy. And you could be going through some type of change and transition. But a lot of times when this card comes out, it's a masculine energy that's going through some type of change and transformation and stuff. Thank you, Azrael, for leading me safely through this change. At the bottom of the deck, we got the miracle of nature. So somebody could be going out in nature, such as water, plants, animals, something like that, the woods. Thank you, angels, for helping me to reconnect through nature and fresh air. All right, cause so, so someone could definitely be having a lot of stress and anxiety, and you, you need to go out in nature if you haven't already, okay? But replenish yourself, nurture yourself. So somebody's definitely focused on that and, like, being happy and doing stuff that makes them happy, which is really good. All right, as soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Capricorns is the Nine of Pentacles. So somebody could definitely be independent, all right? They could be, uh, they love the lavish life or expensive things or something like that. But also somebody going through some type of rebirth. They could have decided to go at it alone or do things alone in some type of way. And there are people who are interested on how you're doing this or what you're doing. But you got your guards up with these people, okay? You ready to defend yourself and defend your work because right under is the Queen of Pentacles. So so somebody has uh, stability, security. Somebody been working on their fo focused on their health, wealth, and beauty and stuff like that. And you could be defending your nest, defending what you work for, defending your business, stuff like that, right? And that's what I'm saying. People trying to get in, trying to figure you out, but also they got some type of love hate situation going on with you. Can I please have a few cards for my Capricorns? Yeah, see, it's drastic changes. The wheel of fortune is here, which is some of y'all could be seeing five, five, five a lot too. All right, but things are changing, especially for a masculine energy that you could be dealing with. The five of wands, which is about competition, jealousy, and conflict. All these people are arguing or fighting over the same thing. Okay, so what's a lot of that going on? At because they mad at this person choosing to be independent, going at it alone, and they like the lavish life. So, somebody could feel like you could be materialistic or you have nice things and stuff like that, and they want to fight over it or fight for something that you have. The Queen of Swords could be an Aquarius, Libra, or Gemini, but somebody could be a bit angry or want to know the truth about something in some type of way. Let me see what's under there. The Two of Swords, because somebody indecisive and confused, they want the fucking truth, they want to be not played the fuck with. And we got judgment. It's a lot of judgment going down. Because somebody victorious and successful also could be arguments about some type of car situation. Five of Swords. Okay, so we got the Five of Swords and the Five of Ones. Multiple people are involved. All arguing about something that you have. Whether it's your love or your business, your career. Whatever it is, they want your abundance. They want something that you have. And somebody trying to come in between a divine contract. The Six of Pentacles. You somebody getting the fuck. You see the money. Somebody mad about somebody getting money and opportunities and shit. That hurt me. And somebody been detached. They could be detached, but still watching you, trying to get more information on you in some type of way. And somebody mad that you didn't give something to them too. As soon as I open up the deck, we'll be saying for my Capricorn. The bag. The money trying to focus on my money and be financially stable so your masculine could be trying to work on their money right now too the karmic has a weird love hate thing going on for you now the karmic is not always the other woman karmics can be family members and friends too like i said they don't know if they love you or hate you and for some of y'all it's somebody in your own damn family Oh, you are adorable and deserve to be spoiled. So they mad that your person wants to spoil you. Because remember, somebody keeps coming out at the Nine of Pentacles, which is they love nice things. They always looking fancy or somebody calling them materialistic or spoiled or some shit like that. All right. <clears throat> I love you. I think I might just do anything for you. So your person definitely deeply in love with you. They want to do for you. They want to spoil you. 
we are connected when you go to sleep at night do you dream of me because i dream of you so y'all got this deep connection but somebody trying to come in between a divine contract but this could be a non-committal fuck boy so they could definitely be dealing with multiple people they could also be afraid of commitment so there's definitely trust issues here we got marry me this was coming out in aquarius reading too if i'm not mistaken if i propose to you would you say yes let's move in together all right not but they got non-committal um tendencies and it says the karmic is broke, thirsty, and draining divine masculine for his money. So it's somebody that he feel like he got to take care of. He could have a family or like a baby mama or something like that that he got to take care of. But somebody draining him for his money. But he definitely working on getting more money at this time. <clears throat> as soon as I open up the deck, the energy for my Capricorns is yeah somebody got a jealous friend so we did just see that card talking about i hope my friend doesn't find that i'm talking to him all right so uh, and, and you did have talk about you had a card talking about has mutual friends so somebody mutual friends or family members something like that it could all be connected because remember you had a card talking about everybody was that y'all knew about it so they're all involved so that means it's a circulation multiple people know each other including your family members but a jealous friend was trying to fuck on your person or trying to sabotage someone's connection here and also something about your work they a hater hater is right under trying to discredit your work so some type of work some type of business something that you create they were trying to discredit make it look like it's not uh the best or real or something like that okay <clears throat> But somebody mad about your business or something. They tried to fuck all your shit up. Can I please have a few cards for my Capricorns? Yeah, shit going down behind your back. They ain't want you to know about it, but you finding about it anyways, right? Now motherfuckers feel stupid. I feel so stupid. Now I hope you will wait for me. Because somebody listened to them lies that they was telling, all right? Let's build a happy, stable family. That's what they want with you, okay? Because they see somebody has the Queen of Pentacles, um, which is uh, also wifey material. Yep, but they was talking to people that don't like you, your mutual friends, your family members, okay? But now they like, don't give up on us. I post about you on social media because that's why we seen social injustice. My dick doesn't get hard for them. So they don't, they don't even interested in them like that. I want you and her too. So they definitely is um got that non-committal situation going on. You also had um get rid of your options. I'm all you need and stuff like that. So they definitely had options. All right, we got something about drunk sex. You could be a great communicator. People could like to get advice from you or someone. And we got bad bitch. You're a divine feminine, right? Somebody could have been molested as a child. But it's say take me back, baby. So someone's definitely wanting to go back to their lover, their divine union, after um, messing up and listening to lies. It's a, some type of workplace drama going on. So somebody having issues at work. She knows. So they could have been dealing with somebody at work and she know about you or something like that. So this person that they was working with could be trying to attack you in some type of way or talk shit about you in some type of way. And now your person is like, when I hurt you, I hurt myself. So they feel like they should have never did that shit. And you got a whole bunch of hidden enemies. All right. Um, but not saying this shit to your face that they doing this shit behind your back. And you got a target. That's what I'm saying. Target on your back. They were trying to play you, okay? Let me get some of these cap. Hold on. All right. As soon as I open up the deck, we'll be seeing for my caps. My life started when I met you, and I hope you will wait for me. So there's an energy of waiting, some type of pause or something like that. Can I please have a few calls for my Capricorn? I need more balance. Somebody need balance right now. They trying to figure some shit out and they got a choice to make. I know you from somewhere. So, and that's what I'm saying. I don't like when this card come out because that's why you have stuff like mutual friends. That's why you have stuff like, um, they all knew about it. So they're all involved. This is some type of circle shit, group shit. Everybody know each other. They all talking about being messy, gossiping shit like that. All right? Uh, but somebody saying that they knew you or they had some information about you. Know the fuck that these motherfuckers was lying. Okay? 
I can't even look at you right now. That's what I'm trying to tell you. Like, somebody was on that bullshit. They listened to this bullshit. Now right, we got a yes. Ace of Swords. That means the truth coming at. I'm obsessed with your body. So somebody definitely has a nice body or something like that. And they obsessed with it. I can't even look at you right now and then no is trying to stick out. All right. So something is a yes, something is a no. Some type of truth definitely coming out with Ace of Swords and yes. Okay. All right, 20. As soon as I open up that, what we seeing from my caps? Yeah, he is learning how to fight for the people he loves. So now that he didn't found out all these people was lying on you or some shit like that, now he's trying to take up for you. Your family feels so embarrassed because everyone knows what they did. Your family members did this shit. Your person could be physically choosing them, but emotionally choosing you. All right? So somebody feels like obligated or stuck in a situation where they can't be with you or something like that, okay? my Capricorn spirit okay it says behind the scenes there's another spiritual person who is helping you fight against this person who was trying to sabotage yeah all right so you could be a spiritualist a terrorist a psychic right but there's another spiritualist who's trying to help you out within this situation because they know what this person is trying to do to you I get prettier every time a man disappoints me. So somebody leveling up, especially within their beauty, working on their health, wealth, and beauty. But you need to be aware. A fake friend is trying to throw you off their trail. That bitch ain't shit. Digging because they see they still trying to dig on information on you, trying to make up shit because they don't want you to be successful or um have some type of love situation. You don't know them, but they, that's what I'm trying to say to you. I know you from somewhere. No, the fuck they don't. Everyone is backing out because this is not what they signed up for. They was being guided by toxic people to do bad things to you. Round here, hating on your accomplishment. This is some sad shit. Self-inflicted pain. Everything I did to you has backfired. That's what they ass get. You're a woman who deserves to be taken care of. They tried to play you like you was spoiled or rotten or um um thought too much of yourself or some shit like that. When you deserve the shit, you you being a good person, you out here helping people, you out here not trying to hurt motherfuckers. Yeah, of course you deserve to be loved on and spoiled and all type of shit like that. Fuck around with them. Something about a nail technician or somebody could be talking about some type of nails or something like that, or somebody could be getting their nails dead. But the karmic regrets getting in the middle of y'all's connection. Three-way call. All right, which means that multiple people are all talking about this. All right, it could be an actual call, a group chat, something like that. Somebody could be over-emotional. Everyone knows something is up. Something about a sip and paint or somebody could be going to one or some shit like that. And it says, he has fear in the back of his mind that she is going to tell you what he did. Because he was listening to some bullshit at first. What is this? They lied to everybody to make it look like you did it. That's what I'm saying. And it's coming out. It's being exposed. That's that truth. The karmic drives by Divine Feminine's house or wherever she be at. You being studied. You being heavily studied right now, even by your family members. They going to take you for everything you got if you let them. Because somebody was trying to play you like you was a gold digging whore or you was spoiled or whatever the fuck. Somebody was just trying to set him up. Okay? So, please like this video if it resonated. Uh, thank y'all so much. I love y'all.